Hello and welcome to another taste test. Today I am doing supermarket own brands chicken chow mein ahead of Chinese New Year next Tuesday. I have chicken chow mein from m &S, Asda, Tesco, Aldi and Waitrose. So I'm going to give them all a go and see which one I think is best, which one's worst, what the differences are so that you can pick up the tastiest from the supermarket. So first up, I'm going to try the Tesco's chicken chow mein. So I'm going to go microwave it and then come and try it. Just taken the Tesco chicken chow mein out of the oven. First impression is that it is a bit dry. I can't see much sauce there. And I'm going to give it a go. Okay, I'm going in with the Tesco chicken chow mein. I'm going to try some noodles. They are quite dry. There's not much flavour to them really. I'm going to try some veg now. I'm not really getting the soy sauce through. It's nice, it's fine. Oh, I can taste a bit of chilli in there actually. That's quite nice coming through. But other than that, it is quite bland. I forgot to say about this Tesco one as well, is there is very, very little chicken in here. I would be very disappointed if I'd gone for a chicken chow mein instead of a vegetable one. And I honestly, so far, I've only seen one bit of chicken. It's all right, but it's nothing special. I wouldn't get this one again. Okay, so next I'm trying the Waitrose chicken chow mein and it's egg noodles, chicken and veg in a soy and rice wine sauce. It actually looks quite nice, there's a bit more moisture to this one and I like it in the circular pot. I think it makes it a bit more appetising. It's a very good portion size too so let's give it a go. Now this comes with very big chicken pieces. This is one of the smaller ones I've just picked out but picking that out that's almost too big for a mouthful but I am glad it does have more chicken than the Tesco one. That is tasty. You can, you can taste the char grilled on that. I'm gonna try some of the noodles and the veg together now. I much prefer this one to the Tesco. It's much more moist. I can really, really taste the soy sauce coming through. That's actually really nice. The only thing I preferred in the Tesco version is it has a bit of, of spice with the chilies, which I do like but overall this is so much nicer. Okay, I'm gonna try the Aldi version now. So. so here I have the Aldi chicken chow mein. This looks quite nice. Lots of moisture in there, if you can see. It's all kind of full to one side. Good amount of chicken, although it does look a little bit dry, but I'll give that a go. So first impressions is the chicken is very, very dry. Mm. Taste it too. Tastes like cardboard. Mm, that's not nice. That chicken is so cardboardy because it's so dry and it just takes you ages to chew it. Not what you want really. And the noodles look nice. I like that they've got a bit more liquid to them. You can see the brown colouring that's from the soy sauce on the bottom. They're very soft noodles. They are a little bit bland. They're a bit bland but they're a much nicer consistency than the Tesco's ones. This is very different to the Tesco version. This one also has chilies in though. Just in comparison to the Tesco version, you can see how dry, this is the Tesco, this is the Aldi, you can see how dry the Tesco looks. There's no moisture in the bottom at all, whereas this one has a pool at the bottom. So overall bland, chicken tastes like cardboard, but I like the moisture. Another thing about the Aldi one is there is very little veg in here really. There's a few bits of cabbage and that's it, and the chilies. Okay, this is the Asda one. I'm gonna try and get some noodles on my fork. That didn't go well. Okay, I can't get this on my fork, it's very slimy. It's a bit like a pad thai actually. It's got that kind of peanutty taste to it. It's in a soy, ginger and garlic sauce. None of the others have ginger or garlic in. Nice bits of chicken, very moist, very different to the Aldi. I'm gonna try some veg now. Nice, everything's nice and coated in that soy, ginger and garlic sauce, which is nice. I like this one. 
it's a little bit soft, a little bit slimy, but it tastes good and it's got all the components that I was looking for in a chow mein, so I'm impressed. Okay, next I'm gonna try the MLS chicken chow mein. It's a bit of a bigger portion size. It says it's got egg noodles, char grilled chicken, and fresh vegetables in a soy and Shaoxing rice wine sauce. So let's give that a go. I've got MS chicken chow mein. First impressions, there's a very good amount of chicken here. That's probably the biggest proportion of chicken I've seen in any of them so far. Nice amount of veg, slightly smaller amount of noodles. I think this is a bit of a healthier one, probably. Going in with a bit of chicken, it's very hot. Mm. That is very nice, actually. Very moist. I keep bringing these comparisons back to the Audi one, but just this chicken compared to the Audi chicken, there's no competition at all. I'm gonna try some noodles now. Oh, that's got a very nice sauce, actually. Now this one has peppers in too. None of the others had that. They had chili peppers, but not sweet peppers. It's also got cabbage, bean sprouts, carrots. I will say though, the vegetables aren't very moist, the noodles and the chicken are, but the veg are a bit dry I think. You definitely need to give this one a mix. I think the sauce has got to the bottom again, but once you have it, it's absolutely fine. I mean the noodles, you can see that, they've got loads of sauce on. I like this one and I think it tastes the most authentic. Okay, so final verdict, Waitrose top, m and second, Asda third, Tesco fourth, and Audi at the bottom, just because that chicken was inedible, really. But overall, I'm very impressed by the supermarket's offerings. Um, I really, really love Chinese food, and I wouldn't hesitate to go pick up a supermarket ready meal now instead of going and getting a Chinese takeaway, and it would work out a lot cheaper because as we know, Chinese takeaways do add up because you need to get a few of different plates. And what's nice about these is you get all the noodles and all the chicken in one. So, well done Waitrose.